Welcome back to Let's Play Mass Effect. I'm Hunter Black Luna. Really bombastic music considering we haven't done anything. I guess we've got fights coming up ahead, so get ready everybody. Oh dear. Alright. Shield boost and... Tally, go ahead and hack that. There we go. Nice aim, Garrus. Not even sure if we needed to. I just felt like using two because... The fuck these guys. Halivan's the Turian homeworld, by the way. Enemy contact. Oh, um, hit that one. Uh, it's the only one we can see, right? Overkill it. Yeah, way overkill. Ow! Fucking knew it. There's a sniper up there, guys. Haha! <laughs> Whoa! Shield boost, come on, shield boost. God damn it. Whatever. There it is, pop your shield boost. Charging the shotgun guy again. Because I'm just great at that strategery stuff. Last offensive power. Come on, ship. There you go. Even more bitches. Getting hit with one of those things with my shields down probably wouldn't be my brightest move. Alright, pop shields, move up. Actually, you know, let's pull back. I don't use my actual gun enough, ironically enough. Which is not a problem you think Shepard would have. God, those guys are accurate. But... Also, really cool bullet effect. Right into Tally. That makes me angry. Alright, where is he? Line him up real good. You can actually pop a power on him from this distance. And it's possible it'll work. Although, realistically, you want to close. Oh, there's Garrus's tech power. If you don't... Certain powers like that will become what we call tech mines. Also, ow! Totally shot me through the hill, you jackass. No, oh, fuck it. Make Explodey. Make Explodey was my nickname in high school, by the way. I'll never get tired of stealing that joke from Get Daved. Never. Will he rocket me if I'm right here? Oh, he won't get the chance, will he? Give him the old... Perimeter clear. I guess it was just the old one, the old haymaker. That's the good stuff. How are our powers? Mostly recharged. That's good. I'm gonna hit the quick save, everybody. For no reason at all. Ha! Huh. Now you can't tell when I'm really genuine about that and when there's some big event I'm afraid of actually you can probably tell one way or another here yeah that thing we fought in the Mako not so easy now that we can't just abuse it and run it over. Also, cover is really important. And these boxes break, have I mentioned that? Actually, I don't think they do. That would be a little imba. Alright. Let's focus on the snipers and the ghosts, first of all. 
to that effect, I want... Tally probably wouldn't be able to hack the armature. That would be insane. I don't even want to try. Tally will hack the sniper. Me and Garrus will make explodies on these guys. Also, that thing's blast. I'm pretty sure it's one hit kill. If it's not, then it's one hit, like, incredibly painful. Just gotta wear it down over time. Wow, we're actually overheated. Wonder why the damn thing isn't firing. Whatever, I will take a piece of shit glitching out. I'll fucking take that. Huh. Huh. I remember dying on this fight. Yes, on easy mode. Think we're good, Commander. Yeah, we got him. Remember to stay hydrated. That is very important. My people have searched many generations for a world to call home. If we landed here, we'd just keep searching. It's twitching! Sorry, Tally, um what were you saying? Now is not the time! <laughs> there might be stuff over there, but oh, I don't care. And we're gonna pause here for a little bit. I'll be right back, from your perspective. And we're finally back. Charge. <laughs> I don't know, Shepard is making a pretty good pace down the tunnel, considering I just fall. Now it gets fun. It's weird that Tally would call fighting fun, I don't know. Why? Maybe it's just cause my I have like no shields now. Which is unfortunate. I can do with shields a bit better than the AI because I can avoid getting shot for a little bit of time. Whereas the AI often cannot. Also, it's nice to call down companion powers when they don't even have line of sight sometimes. That's the last of them. It's really good stuff. Alright. Just take this elevator down here. It looks like this cavern formed around the ruin after it was built. That certainly looks promising. Impregnable force field. And like an ancient force field too, I think. Also kinda cool view of that tunnel. Yet another elevator. Helps you genuflect on the meaning of life and stuff while you ride. And the fact that Tally has really weird like the lower part of her legs I think they're called chicken legs or something now you know how aliens are don't you know by the way assault drones fucking barrier and Whatever, just... Oh, you already hacked. These guys are kind of tough. I wonder what Liara's looking for in here. Most Prothean ruins have nothing more than dead instrumentation. That's the million dollar question. Oh, ancient ruins usually have something significant in these sort of stories. Like the one you visit is different. Oh, lovely. Let's 
Let's get out of here, everybody. Hello. Uh, hello. Could somebody help me, please? Can you hear me out there? I'm trapped. I need help. You okay? What happened to you? Listen, this thing I'm in is a Prothean security device. I cannot move, so I need you to get me out of it, all right? All right. We just need to figure some way past this energy field. It's a Prothean barrier curtain. I knew it would keep me safe from the Geth. When I turned it on, I must have hit something I wasn't supposed to. I was trapped in here. You must get me out, please. Nice. We'll find some way to help you. There is a control in here that should deactivate this thing. You'll have to find some way past the barrier curtain. That's the tricky part. The defenses cannot be shut off from the outside. I don't know how you'll get in here. Be careful. There is a Krogan with the Geth. They have been trying different ways to get past the barrier. A Krogan's not so bad, I suppose. I'm gonna get that clock killed. I'm just gonna murder it. I don't know if you can murder a clock. But I'm gonna fucking do it. Hey Tally, did you miss or something? Her AI hacking doesn't seem to be doing too much. Oh! That one resolved some of the problems. We still got one more wise guy. Fancies himself a sniper. And something interesting. Hmm. Well, if we can't break through the barrier, let's just come in under it. But first... Any decent loot to be had over here? I mean, this is a big old camp. Ah. My RPG player sense was not disappointed. Anti-personnel rounds are the good stuff. We'll equip them when we need them. So is this Liara's camp? And I guess it makes sense that she has all sorts of guns and stuff, but this looks like a multi-person operation. I don't think the Geth use this camp. Do the Geth use camps? Like at all? Whatever. We'll just say they're ancient runes too and uh, have done with them. Mini game time everybody. But before that, well, bam, quick save. No. All right, up green, up green. You just use process of elimination for this thing. And yes, I'm just using Wazda for this. Wait, I'm derping. This shouldn't be taking... There we go. That, that. Alright, this, 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 this. Also, I'm not sure if the puzzle randomizes every time. There we go. Ha. And just like that, we have blasted our way in. Took me a couple tries, but... It's because I'm not very bright sometimes.
up we go. How? Oh, how did you get in here? I didn't think there was any way past the barrier. Superior fire. We blasted through with the mining laser. Of course. Yes, that makes sense. Please, get me out of here before Morgeth arrive. That button over there should shut down this containment field. Wait, Commander. Can we trust her? Her mother's working with Saren. I am not my mother. I don't even... I don't know why Benezia joined Saren. I don't want anything to do with that Turian bastard. If she was with Saren, the Geth wouldn't be trying to kill her. That is a good point. We didn't even get to say Dr. Tassoni, I presume, which Any is Any idea how we get out of this place? There is an elevator back in the center of the tower. At least I, I think it's an elevator. It should take us out of here. Come on! I, I still cannot believe all this. Why would the Geth come after me? Do you think Benezia is involved? Seren's looking for the conduit. You're a Prothean expert. He probably wants you to help him find it. The conduit? But I don't know... What the hell was that? These ruins are not stable. That mining laser must have triggered a seismic event. Nice going, Shepard. We have to hurry. The whole place is caving in. Joker, get the Norm of the Airborne and lock in on my signal. On the double, mister! Aye, aye, Commander. Secure and away. ETA, eight minutes. He needs to move faster. What's he gonna do? Get out and push? It's a jet plane, Tally. Eight minutes is eight minutes. I guess if my life on the line was on the line, I'd be uh, complaining too. I don't like this ad guy's attitude. We don't have time to deal with this idiot. Charge! <laughs> <laughs> I like your attitude. Usually I'm not so renegade, but I can't be bothered with this motherfucker. Alright, prioritization. Tally, grab the rocket trooper, if you can do it. Garrus and I are gonna focus on overloading the shit out of that battle master. Oh, that's the good stuff. Oh, he's probably going to hit me. I ain't gonna pop a barrier. And with another round of tech powers, yep. God damn it. Fucking kill him, guys. There we go. Liara is being eminently helpful in the corner. Oh, damping, right? Whatever. Too close, Commander. 
Ten more seconds we would have been swimming in molten sulfur. The Normandy isn't equipped to land in exploding volcanoes. They tend to fry our sensors and melt our hull. Just for future reference. We almost died out there and your pilot is making jokes? Hooker pulled our asses out of there. I think he's earned the right to a few bad jokes. I see. It must be a human thing. I don't have a lot of experience dealing with your species, Commander. But I am grateful to you. You saved my life back there, and not just from the volcano. Those Geth would have killed me or dragged me off to Saren. What did Saren want with you? Do you know something about the conduit? Only that it was somehow connected to the Prothean extinction. That is my real area of expertise. I have spent the past 50 years trying to figure out what happened to them. 50 years? Just how old are you exactly? I hate to admit it, but I am only 106. Jesus. Damn. I hope I look that good when I'm your age. A century may seem like a long time to a short-lived species like yours. But among the Asari, I am barely considered more than a child. That is why my research has not received the attention it deserves. Because of my youth, other Asari scholars tend to dismiss my theories on what happened to the Protheans. I've got my own theory on why the Protheans disappeared. With all due respect, Commander, I have heard every theory out there. The problem is finding evidence to support them. The Protheans left remarkably little behind. It is almost as if someone did not want the mystery solved. It is like someone came along after the Protheans were gone and cleansed the galaxy of clues. But here is the incredible part. According to my findings, the Protheans were not the first galactic civilization to mysteriously vanish. This cycle began long before them. Where'd you come up with this theory? I thought there wasn't any evidence. I have been working on this for 50 years. I have tracked down every scrap and shred of evidence. Eventually, subtle patterns start to emerge. Patterns that hint at the truth. It is difficult to explain to someone else. I cannot point to one specific thing to prove my case. It is more a feeling derived from a half-century of dedicated research. But I know I'm right, and eventually I will be able to prove it. There were other civilizations before the Protheans. This cycle has repeated itself many times over. All of this has happened before, and all of it will happen again. And there's your BSG reference for the video, everybody. If the Protheans weren't the first, then who was? I don't know. There is barely any evidence on the Protheans, even less on those who came before them. I cannot prove my theory, but I know I am right. The galaxy is built on a cycle of extinction. Each time a great civilization rises up, it is suddenly and violently cast down. Only ruins survive. The Protheans rose up from a single world until their empire spanned the entire galaxy. Yet even they climbed to the top on the remains of those who came before. Their greatest achievements, the mass relays and the citadel, are based on the technology of those who came before them. And then, like all the other forgotten civilizations throughout galactic history, the Protheans disappeared. I have dedicated my life to figuring out why. <laughs> Once again, this game is great if you just want to be a total dick. They were wiped out by a race of sentient machines. The Reapers. The... the Reapers? But I have never heard of... How do you know this? What evidence do you have? There was a damaged Prothean beacon on Eden Prime. It burned a vision into my brain. I'm still trying to sort out what it all means. Visions? Yes, that makes sense. The beacons were designed to transmit information directly into the mind of the user. Finding one that still works is extremely rare. No wonder the Geth attacked Eden Prime. The chance to acquire a working beacon, even a badly damaged one, is worth almost any risk. But the beacons were only programmed to interact with Prothean physiology. Whatever information you received would have been confused, unclear. I am amazed you were able to make sense of it at all. A lesser mind would have been utterly destroyed by the process. You must be remarkably strong-willed, Commander. This isn't helping us find Shepard Sarah. Shepard punches robots Kata. in the face of on course, a regular right. basis. I am sorry, my scientific curiosity got the better of me. Unfortunately, I do not have any information that could help you find the conduit, or Saren. Let's see, she punches robots in the face, dodges exploding volcanoes... Strong-willed is a good description. I don't know why Saren wanted you out of the picture, but I think we'll be a lot better off if we bring you along. Thank you, Commander. 
Saren might come after me again. I cannot think of anywhere safer than here on your ship. And my knowledge of the Protheans might be useful later on. And her biotics will come in handy when the fighting starts. Great, another alien. Good to have you on the team, Liara. Thank you, Commander. I am very grateful. Oh, I am afraid I am feeling a bit lightheaded. When was the last time you ate? Or slept? Dr. Chakwa should take a look at you. It is probably just mental exhaustion, coupled with the shock of discovering the Protheans' true fate. I need some time to process all this. Still, it could not hurt to be examined by a medical professional. It will give me the chance to think things over. Are we finished here, Commander? We can talk again after you've seen the doctor. The rest of you, dismissed. Mission reports are filed, Commander. You want me to patch you through to the Council? Goody. Patch him through, Joker. Setting up the link now, Commander. We've received your report, Commander. I understand Dr. Tassoni is on the Normandy. I assume you're taking the necessary security precautions. Oh yeah, if she sneezes at us, I'm totally gonna put a bullet through her brain, Ambassador. Liara's on our side. The Geth were trying to kill her. Benezia would never allow Saren to kill her daughter. Maybe she doesn't know. Or maybe we don't know her. We never expected she could become a traitor. At least the mission was a success. Apart from the utter destruction of a major Prothean ruin. Was that really necessary, Shepard? I don't care about the past. You can also hang up at any time. Ah, it gets pretty funny, too. The Geth were crawling all over those ruins. We were lucky to make it out alive. Of course, Commander. The mission must always take priority. Good luck, Commander. Remember, we are all counting on you. Is it just me or did the Asari Counselor's eyes look really weird? Also, we got an achievement for that. And we can examine that for more EXP. Let's get ourselves leveled up, everybody. Still can't get more charm, not surprised. I'm fine with that. Holy crap. We got a lot of experience while I wasn't looking. Oh. New biotic power. Good stuff. We're about halfway up the Paragon chain. I'm surprised we didn't get Renegade for just going kill him. At the Krogan Battlemaster guy, but eh. Point defense systems. Can we examine them from here? Yes, we can. Well, next time on Let's Play Mass Effect, uh, we're going to talk to people, see what they think about the mission, and probably more side quests, very frankly. Thank you for watching. I'm Hunter Black Luna, and I'll see you guys next time.